an online course is somewhat of a foreign concept, so I want to show you that as you log into the classroom, you can access the group space. If you'll notice on the left links, the option called Course Tools, there is a section in there called Groups, but I want to bring your attention to this item down here below called My Groups. Once you are assigned a group, the My Groups will show up for you automatically. So you are not expected to create a group, I will assign a group for you based on your input. Um, you can access features of the group on the left link or you can go to the group homepage where you'll see things like collaboration, file exchange, and a discussion board. All of these tools should be really helpful in helping you to um, complete your group work together efficiently and effectively. You participate in the discussion board here just like you would participate in the discussion board for the entire class. Uh, this is a chance for you guys to save on email space and um, keep communication centralized. So click on the topic, feel free to create your own topics, um, and press create thread and that will help you to um, make an entry there. Um, if you would like to go back to the home page for the group, You'll also find that the assignments are there on the home page of the group space. Uh, so whichever person is responsible can simply click on the assignment they are submitting. You'll all be able to see these files that are there attached, provided by myself, to make it a little bit easier for you to find. And once you've completed your work, you simply browse to your computer and upload it and then press submit, just like you would any other assignment. And after you submit, it should take you back to the home page or of course you can use the uh, links above or the left links below to navigate back. And I know group work can sometimes come with its challenges, so I hope you'll find that online it can be done well.